<laughs> my head fits in here. This is huge for five dollars. So yeah, that's what I have in my bag for moms that want to take their kids out and they're still potty training or whatever. This is my potty training what's in my bag kit, car kit. I don't even know what you guys want to call it. Three dollars. Honestly, I always wanted a pregnancy pillow. I never got one. So this is my very first one. Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I'm still like deciding whether I like these bangs or not, like curtain bangs. I don't know, but we're on our way to Target to pick up something and then we're gonna go to the park. I need to take these kids out. It's one of those days. Mommy, I mean, Yeah, buddy. Where you been to? What? Where you been? What do you mean, where have I been? I've been here with you. having a conversation of a lifetime back there it's so funny how they're starting to talk to each other and i've been wanting to capture it on camera because it's so cute it's so okay i don't know how i love these i don't know if i love it or not we're gonna pick up some stuff from target and then we're gonna go to the park i want to pick up um some things for easter mommy yes you promise, he promise? Okay, so we just got our drive up order. Oh. Um, I did not expect these baskets to be so big. Look at these. These are huge. Like my whole head could fit in here. And these are five dollars. So this is a Spider-Man one for Leo, and then this is a dinosaur one for Oliver. Literally, <laughs> my head fits in here. This is huge. For five dollars, I recommend. I usually get them at Dollar Tree, but they're so small. And then I also got all these eggs. See how many they bring? three dollars i spent twenty dollars total on two of these for five dollars and then four of these bags there were three dollars each definitely a steal this one's yours don't break it mm. and this one's yours I need do you that. like your dinosaurs yeah, Mama dies awesome Mommy, yeah buddy <laughs> oh my god they're doing it now <laughs> who wants to go to the park all right, give me the baskets. I need them. Come on, we have to go to the park. Give me the baskets. Oh, this is going to be hard. What are you doing? This is baskets. Wow. This is that. This came from. Go say hi. We're just following a squirrel now. <laughs> oh no <laughs> so the kids are here just playing at the park and i actually was just talking to one of the teachers because i didn't know this was like a preschool too next to a playground so she was just talking to me asking me oh how old is he and i was like oh leo he's about to be four um and this and that and she was telling me about the programs that they have she was telling me about the program she said that there's two programs and the requirements for it and stuff and i'm actually considering it because we've been wanting to put him in something but we just haven't found the right place but this place looks really nice and he was actually talking to me about it on the car ride over he was like mommy i want to go to school because he saw the school bus and yeah we were talking about that and he's like no mommy i really do want to go so when he saw the kids and they were lining up and they were coming outside and stuff he was really interested in it and he was just playing with them and he was getting along with the teachers the teachers were just talking to him and he was just good and i don't know i mean i'll talk to my boyfriend about it and we'll see but so far, I mean, so good. So we're here at McDonald's. Um, we had to get some fries, you know, just to end the day good. They look so tired. We haven't been out of the house in a while, so this might be a, too much of an adventure for them. Okay, so something just got in the mail. I have no idea what this is. No idea. So we're gonna find out together. I have no clue. I haven't ordered anything. What the heck? And the thing is that it doesn't even say where it's from or anything and there's two on each side what we got like cupcakes what is this i don't know i don't know it says pillow it says pillow i haven't ordered no pillow oh my god could this be something from the registry someone got me because I did put um, 
bobby pillow in there. Not a bobby pillow. Is it a bobby pillow? It's for the baby's head support. I forgot what it's called. Oh my god. What are you? My Sweet show. Sweet found inside. My show. Oh my god. This is the baby butt pillow. This is a pregnancy pillow. Yes. My Sure. This is a pregnancy pillow, but it's not like those bulky big ones. Um, it's a smaller one, which is the one that I need for the belly support, which is what I need because it's been bothering me a lot lately. My belly has been so uncomfortable when I lay down. So this is so cool. Uh, I can have one. All right, I have to like unpack this, but it's so cool. This is what I got. It's this pillow that you lay in the middle and it's for, you know, belly support. Obviously, it's a pregnancy pillow. But the best thing about it is that you can take this part off and put it closer. You can adjust it. It has this whole roomy area where you can put it closer to your stomach or, you know, expand it. Or, like the classic bit ones, you can put this big old thing in there so you can have more comfort in between your legs. If you need more support for your tummy area, you can adjust it with this one. You can just put this one under it and it's amazing. I just tried it and I really do love it. So uh, thank you so much for this awesome gift, Baby Bob. I love you guys. And honestly, I always wanted a pregnancy pillow. I never got one. So this is my very first one and I love how adjustable and comfortable it is. I love that it's not long, so it's not gonna like take up the whole bed. I love how small and simple it is and I can literally just pack it and take it with me on any of the trips that we go to. So, thumbs up. So much better. How do you wanna do it? I want to wait that. Oh, okay, try it. No, that's not too well, that's like that. Oh, okay, like that? You want me to record you like this? With the phone like this or like this? Uh, like, like this? That. Okay. Whoa, Oliver, you're so strong. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> that was a good one. So we have been outside for like, I want to say an hour maybe. I had to take them outside because we took a nap and then they didn't look tired. And so I thought this would help. So today my boyfriend is working late again. And that means I have to do another night routine by myself, which I'm dreading, but I mean, whatever. So getting ready to do that. <laughs> Why are you doing it like that? Can I see? You're a robot? This is the hard part, getting them inside the house. Come on, let's go. No. Yes. I already need to put these kids to bed. I need to give them a bath really fast and I need to put them to bed because it's been a long day. I'm about to give you guys the tip of a lifetime. If there's anything you guys are taking away from this video, just please watch this next part. Okay, so you guys saw how I went to the park, how I was out like half the day. Now, at first, when I started potty training my kids, I was terrified of taking them out, especially Lil, because he's the one that's still off of diapers. Oliver, I kind of put him back on diapers. But anyways, yeah, I was terrified of taking him out. This is what helped, okay. So I bought these. These are pee pads. I bought them on Amazon. I know there's some also for like babies and whatever, but honestly, these are cheap because these were for like animals. These are like their small ones. And I just want to show you what small means. Look how big this is. Look how big this is. Huge, huge. So I put this in his car seat. I do have to open like a little hole so the strop of between his legs go you know in between his legs but it's fine it still works it still works it absorbs a lot this is what i put under the potty here in the house i have a potty in the car that helps a lot too i keep asking him like i do at home hey do you have to do pee, -pee? no we stop somewhere i put that under like on the floor of the car and then i put the potty and then that's where he goes so far we haven't had an accident and then i want to show you guys what i carry in my toddler training bag i guess you can call it that like potty training bag um because i don't have babies anymore <laughs> but yeah so this is my bag 
so first thing you guys already see that we have water that's essentials um oh this is a pamphlet that the teacher gave me while i was at the park i need to go through that so first things first i open my bag and i already have a bunch of snacks they already ate all the other goldfish and whatever else i had in here so these are my snacks that they also eat then i got my wallet extra clothes i carry two because i have two kids but just in case honestly so far i haven't had to use this i've had this in here for like two weeks now and i haven't had to use them so that's awesome and underwears underwears are essentials i have two here yeah just in case diapers because i still have another one in diapers wipes you need this for anything even if they don't use diapers you just need wipes something else i have in here oh more underwears cool um band-aids i carry band-aids with me because my kids they get a boo-boo they scrape the knee whatever a band-aid fixes everything like in a matter of seconds so i have that and then i also have some little moist towels i got from my doctor's office <laughs> i don't know i just have that in there um i have this my tripod uh then i also carry zip logs just in case like i need to i don't know i need zip logs i also have bags in here i actually just ran out today but i need to put bags in here like um grocery bags like target bags walmart bags like just little those little plastic bags that they hand out like you put groceries in because that's great to put diapers clothes that your toddler has peed on you know just to put it somewhere you just put it in a bag and then you just take it out and then you do laundry or whatever i just rather do that than i don't know just leave it just in the car wet so i just got this to show you how much the pack brings but this is how much i usually carry with me i just carry four i do have some already in the car so i have like a little bin in the car damn i wish i would have taken a picture for you guys i have a little bin in the car that has the potty in there it has the pee pads it has diapers wipes and it also has paper towels in there and grocery store bags so just in case of an accident or whatever you know so yeah that's that's my little like car kit <laughs> if you will for potty training then i have a little notebook because you know mom life pen, and then i also have a pencil i mean a, a pen then i also have diaper rash cream vaseline don't know why just have that in there i have a mirror you know my makeup my pants whatever yeah and then in this pocket in the front because this bag opens this pocket in the front i have uh, mickey and minnie yeah i don't know so yeah that's what i have in my bag for moms that want to take their kids out and they're still potty training or whatever this is my potty training what's in my bag kit car kit i don't even know what you guys want to call it it's been really helpful especially those pee pads i definitely recommend them i will link them down below which ones i got i believe it was like around like 20 something maybe even less i don't know for sure but it brings so many in a pack that's gonna be all for the video i hope you guys enjoyed and i'm gonna go door dash some dinner because i don't feel like cooking tonight anyways that's gonna be all for the video i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys next time bye